this all real? Or is it just happening inside my head? Of course it's happening inside your head, Harry. Why should that mean that it's not real? He's not Fred, I am. Honestly, woman, you call yourself our mother. <laughs> I'm Hello and welcome to book reveal number two. Today I'm here to tell you that yes, you can send your personal copies to Be Rebound rather than buying a new set. If you send your own books, you save $75 on the full set or $10 per book, uh, since that's approximately how much it costs me to purchase these books secondhand. Uh, you will, however, have to pay your own shipping to get the books to me in Canada. There's lots more info on this service that will become available when my site is launched and you'll get a price quote before committing to anything. I've got lots more info and updates on these books, so be sure to hit the follow button so you can stay in the loop. Professor Chaloni. Uh, he will return tonight. Sorry. Uh, tonight, he who betrayed his friends whose heart rots with murder shall break free. Innocent blood shall be spilt, and servant and master shall be reunited once more. Ron, I should tell you, most muggles aren't accustomed to seeing a flying car. Uh, right. Oh no, the invisibility booster must be faulty. <gasps> what? We talked about you sleeping under the invisible cloak. What? It's soft. It's creepy. That's subjective. Just use the regular blanket. What regular blanket? The one sitting right next to you. I, I can't find it. Hey. Where'd it go? I don't know. Invisible cloak, remember? What are you doing now? Finding my blanket. Infrared vision. Now, if you'll excuse me. Are you sleeping with your eyes open? Yes. This is even worse than before. This is what you get! That insolent potter boy gave our house self a sock. Now we have to do everything for ourselves. And now sis's cooking tastes like pool toys. It's embarrassing, really. A witch that can't cook. Drago, what's the matter? I can't eat when the Dark Lord's looking at me like that. Look! So creepy and weird. He's just staring at me. I don't expect me to eat when he's just staring at me like that. Now, there's nothing behind those eyes. It's dead inside. Did he really have to come and stay with us? I mean, all the Death Eaters and we had to be the one that he chose. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. We couldn't keep Dobby, but we had to take on the old wrinkly snake man. It just seems weird. He didn't think we needed a new house elf, but you had to keep around Harry Potter's number one fan. He's literally trying to kill a child. I am also a child. Can you not see why I'd be scared? We can trust him, Draco. Ask him anything. Why don't you have a nose? No? Oh, okay. Right. Here are some quick Harry Potter impressions. You're not going mad. I can see them too. You're just as sane as I am. You boy, is your grandmother quite well? <gasps> I wouldn't be so sure of that. Give me the cup. Oh, mm, kitty. I was just sitting in the U-Ben thinking about death. <sighs> and it fell through the top of my head. Mm -hmm. <coughs> you, 
You foul, loathsome, evil little cockroach! Hello, I'm Rita Skeeter. I write for the Daily Prophet. But of course you know that, don't you? It's you we don't know. You saved her even though she was not yours to save. My little sister! What's my snake of choice? Oh, that'd be a Nagini smackliato with some payback in it. Yes, lovely, it's very nice. Slughorn strode over to a corner cupboard and emerged with two very battered looking copies of advanced potion making by Libatius Borage. Harris saw scribbled along the bottom of the back cover. This book is the property of the Half-Blood Prince. Why the hell am I at a children's party? Why am I here? I don't like children. I don't even like my- Oh, hello, darling. Hi. Yep, yeah, I'm so sorry. Mummy's here. I want to go home. Finally, the food is- What? The- What? What is this? What is this? Okay, I'll just put some sauce on it. Oh, it's not coming up. I'm... This is rubbish. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. The sauce is- What even is this sauce? What? It looks weird. Why is it white? I don't like it. Oh, God. I'm just- I'm too hungry to care. I'm just, I'm just gonna eat the whole thing. Why am I here? I hate children. Don't even like any of this food. It's just ridiculous. I, well, actually, that's really good. Yes, Mrs. Crab, I do think your child is really great, you stupid woman. Lucius, what are we doing here? I think if I just keep eating, I don't actually have to talk to any of these people. Why hasn't he brought me a drink yet? I want a drink. I don't know where the wine is. Tell me there's wine. What the fuck is this? What the, what even? I don't drink things out of a can. I don't drink wine out of a can. I don't drink whatever this is out of a can. Oh, he's finally remembered his bloody mother is still here. Hi, darling. Are you... Who? Who's who's hurt you? Point... Oh, who's hurt you? Who threw you off the playground? No, that's not okay. I'll help you to... Oh, no, okay. You've gone. All right, well, fuck you then. Why is Draco talking to that person? Do we know that person? Well, you don't seem to know who that is. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that girl? Do we know her? No, we don't know who 
Oh no, he's not flirting. Oh no, he's just telling her how he's superior to her. Yeah, that sounds about right. This is actually really awkward mm -hmm. too. And now she's punched him in the face. Great. You can you can deal with it. I'm not dealing with it. Bye. Oh, there's gossip. Okay, what's going on? No, Draco, not now. Okay, mummy's looking at the gossip. What's going on? Oh yeah. Stop hitting me. Go away, for goodness sake. I, I, you haven't even spoken to me this entire time and now you want to speak to me. This is ridiculous. What do you want? Oh, he's showing me he's been punched in the face. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe don't pick on girls then. I know. What am I supposed to do with that information? I'm not... Where the hell is that crab kid going? He's going to fall off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he fell off. <laughs> oh, probably shouldn't be laughing at this. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, put it quick, quick! Pretend you care about this other child. Oh no! Oh, that's so sad. Oh, how could anything happen like that to a brilliant <laughs> child? Jesus Christ! I'm going to hell. Is Draco really supposed to be on the monkey bars? I don't think he's. Oh shit! Excuse me, Professor Snape. Sorry to bother you like this, but I don't suppose my father's there, is he? You see, I tried to call him, but he didn't pick up, and I wondered where he was. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you in a Death Eater meeting? Oh, I didn't realise. Oh, how embarrassing. Is the Dark Lord there? Please send him my apologies. Sorry, Mr. Voldemort. I was just trying to find my dad. Oh, hello, Auntie Bellatrix. Broken out of Azkaban again, I see. Does that mean you'll be joining us this weekend for dinner? Great. Just out of interest, though, is my father actually there? What do you mean he can't come to the phone right now? I'm his son. Why wouldn't he want to talk to me? No, it can't wait. I don't want to tell my mother about this. She just doesn't hate Potter like I do. Stupid Potter. All right, fine. Have it your way. I'll just wait until he gets home. But if you wouldn't mind asking him to pick up a chocolate frog on the way home, I'd really like one. Thank you, Professor. Bye. Prepare to get laced because they're gonna taste my venom. I got that. I'm trying to get 'em, get 'em, get 'em. Not going with 'em.